thank you so much for seeing me today. That's not a problem at all. How can I, how can I help you? My sister says I should talk to you about this problem I'm having with my chest. Mm, I see.
now? Uh, uh, all right, all right, all right. Come over. There are a lot of things we can't understand, Charlene. I couldn't understand until today that I needed to see you. I was never brave enough to come here before. But this dream, this crazy dream, it kept recurring. No, no, that can't be. Your mother's asleep upstairs. My name is Heather Crow. I'm 57 years old, and I'm dying of lung cancer from secondhand smoke. I've been a waitress for 40 years to earn a decent living for, for my daughter and myself. My doctor told me I had a smoker's tumor, and therefore uh, I'm dying. I never smoked a day in my life. When I got sick, there was absolutely no doubt that I would do this that I had to make a public awareness. The people that I, I spoke to didn't know that uh, secondhand smoke kills, they weren't aware of it. So therefore I had to get the message out across Canada and to get the politicians to change the labour laws. In 2002, barely 5% of Canadians lived in jurisdictions where there was protection from secondhand smoke in the workplace and public places. By the end of this year, 80% of Canadians will live in such jurisdictions. That phenomenal change in just a few years is due mostly to the efforts of Heather Crow. Everybody was there as soon as I was wanting to do something, you know? It's still not over yet. Working in rural locations is, uh, uh, or even austere locations, uh, it can be challenging in many ways from the uh, logistics of uh, being able to get there, uh, no cab company to get you to the uh, location that you have to work, uh, no lodge to stay in. I've uh, slept overnight in a, in a classroom, that's the expected place for visitors to stay, and, uh, and use the, the shower in the gymnasium to get ready in the morning. Uh, so uh, something, sometimes things are quite austere, uh, but it's a lot of fun and we, we get in and, and we're able to help uh, these communities uh, get, get connected to the rest of the world. <laughs> 